Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I will show you on how I edit my YouTube videos. So for my editing tool, I used iMovie. So currently on the screen that I'm showing you right now is the iMovie application. And uh, on how you can get this iMovie, you can just go to their website. You can go to apple.com and from here there's an option for you to download iMovie for Mac OS. Okay? And mind you, this app is for free. So for those of you who are using Apple products, say for example on your um, iPhone, you can download iMovie. Um, iPad you can also download iMovie so you can edit your videos and for those who are using their laptops like the, Mac the MacBook Pro or MacBook Air uh, this this application is just for free okay so uh, let me now show you the iMovie um, application so I've already downloaded it from that website and have it installed and I have been using this for quite a while now this is the application that I'm using for me to edit my YouTube videos so um, yeah there this is just a very simple um, movie or video editing tool okay uh, I, I just self studied it and also of course um, check videos on uh, YouTube or on Google on how to uh, get everything done and how you can create a, a good quality uh, video or product so first things first of course for you to have something on your dashboard so this is like a dashboard part this is where you can put all your media so yeah this is the my media like my media dashboard something like that so for you to get all your raw movies or your raw photo you can just click on this drop down our button right here this is on how you can import your videos from your camera recorder or your phone or yeah anything you would like to get those uh, raw videos or media so from here you can just look for the the folder where you need to get those media okay so for this example for this video let's just use this this video that i have right here on my my media dashboard so let me just before we go through creating a new video let's just go ahead and check on all of the icons right here this buttons right here so we're done with my media so next is the audio so on this application uh, sound effects is already part of the iMovie application so this is being offered by iMovie for free so there is a theme music right here that you can choose from and there's a lot of that you can play with you can play around with okay there's effects there's sound effects I love sound effects and a lot more you can just play around around once you have already installed iMovie on your system okay and you can also um, get uh, background movies via iTunes so yeah if you if you're familiar with how you can download um, music or sound from from free yeah downloadable music or sounds to any source then that would automatically be forwarded to iTunes and then you can just uh, get that from iTunes and have that um, used as your background music or background sound so uh, in most of my videos I use the band sound and uh, all the music or sounds from band sound uh, their website is www.bensound.com and all of the uh, music and uh, sounds that you're going to download from the site is just for free you just need to credit the owner okay every time you upload videos on youtube you just need to credit the owner okay so yeah so that's how i uh, downloaded most of uh, or that's how i in integrated or put on mo most of the music on my videos from band sound and of course any other sources like the audio library I think from YouTube so those were no copyright and a lot more I, I think there's a lot more but I just 
like the band sound music though. So next tab is the titles. So here you can select, there are a variety of styles right here and you can just play around with two. Okay, and there's also some effects right like that. Okay, stuff like that. So really up to you and how you can, on how you would like to design your, your uh, or how you would like to edit your video. And next tab is the background. So backgrounds, there are preloaded backgrounds here. And lastly, the transitions. So it is also add up um, like cinemato cinematography on your video, right? Um, the way it switched to another scene or to another video. So um, this is again really up to you. So um, we're done with the, the buttons or the functionalities on the tabs right here. So uh, we can start on trying to edit our uh, video. Okay. So all you need to do is you can, if you notice, um, if you can notice, there's like a plus sign right here. You can either click that so it will get added to your, um, I think this is like a storyboard. I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, I think that's the storyboard. So let's just delete the other one. Okay, or you can drag. So earlier, uh, as you can see, I've just dragged it and or you can just click on the the plus sign okay and from here uh, if you would right click on your media there's a lot of actions that you can do on your media so you can play you can cut you can copy you can delete you can split the clip you can add freeze frame detach audio trim to playhead show clip trimmer so in my experience um, I only yeah, I, I only use the detach audio, split clip, cut, copy. Those were just a very basic thing that I usually used on this these actions right here. Okay, so cat for you to split the the um, clip, you just need to click on the portion where you would wanna uh, split the clip. So for example, and if you can see the yellow line right here, this indicates where the split would start okay right click and then split and it would get split okay and then um if for all of the um, actions that you would like or yeah actions or functions that you would like to do on your raw video just need to highlight it as you can see if we're not going to highlight it it would not take effect on your video okay so highlight first and make sure that you can see it's the it's highlighted in yellow I think that's a default color highlight and uh, you can do uh, a, a lot of like editing here okay styles here so you can do color balance you can do um, so this is a color balance and this one uh, also I think color balance just same thing and this if you would like to crop your video and this if we would like your video to have a stable shaky video I haven't tried this in most of my videos but maybe you can try on your own and this if you would like to um, yeah you would like to yeah I think you need you just play around and how you would like your video to um, yeah on how you, you edit your video really up to you and this is on how you reduce the background noise and there's like a percentage if you want it at a hundred percent 50 or 70 up to you and the equalizer depending on your surround depending on the, the setting where you're in so if it's kind of like very um, very noisy then you can re try to reduce the background and this is the speed of the, your video so there's a normal slow fast freeze frame custom and it's again up to you and this one is the audio effect so there's yeah there's a lot to choose from so here we go okay and lastly i'm not sure what it what's this i think it's just the information about this clip that we're about to create okay 
so let's try to like um, put some yeah put some can inlay there's the background all right and you can also put some title like that that's how you do it and you can edit the the text hi just a test and you can also click on here to change the color of your font or your text okay and you could also change the the um, size of your text and you could change the font up to you All right okay and then what else I think that's pretty much it um, uh, me personally uh, I just love it simple and uh, straight to the point okay if you would also like to put some transitions say for example you can split this because we only have one or one file or media so you can drag the transition right here like that simply drag okay and if you would like to see the effect so simply like that okay and if you would also like to remove the audio on your video you can click on detach audio and you can just if you would like if you wish to delete it then delete all right okay so i think that's pretty much it about this imovie uh, editor and if finally if you would like to save this this video and you're ready to have it uploaded on your youtube channel then uh yeah let me show you how click on this uh, this looks like an exit button so you just need to click on it and then i personally yeah use the file option but you can play around with the other options though so i personally use this file option save it so say for example sample movie and then hit next Okay, save it at the desktop so it'll be easier for us to locate that after. And there would be an indication right here if your your movie or your file had already been exported successfully and as you can see it moves. Okay, there's like a status indication if it's almost done or yeah. So if it's of course if it's a small file then it would be uploaded or exported that quick okay just like this and if you would like to show it and then play it say for example play then you have your iMovie product okay so if you can see the quality um, it has a very good quality right and on the youtube channel you could also set the setting to have your follower or your viewer view it on a hd quality yeah you can have that okay and uh, i think that's it for now i hope you learned something today about the imovie on how you can create your um i your video to upload on YouTube which is a, a free application from um, Apple um, that would work on all of the Apple products such as your phone your iPad and Apple laptops thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe on our channel and hit the notification bell so you will get notified whenever a new video is being uploaded thank you bye